it's all right because she's been dealing with them. Let's get it. Maybe a little tipsy right now. A little. <laughs> a little. <laughs> And I can't let you run away, girl, you're not called a rape. And a massage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, now we in this motherfucker. Period, yeah! There it is! I'm gonna cut and I got this one out. Yeah, I like that. I'm outside in a damn cheap. Right outside. TT. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be the start of another Living Along Weekly Vlog. Thank you so much for tuning in and clicking on this video. Your support means the absolute most to me. If you're new here, hey girl, my name is Akira Janae. Don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave. So, it's Monday, February 5th, 11.15. I just got done with my dentist appointment. Um, I don't know if I put that before this footage right here or I'm going to pop that in now. But... Oh my gosh. Hopefully she says it'll be an easy case. Yeah, let's hope. Yeah. But like, make sure you ask her everything and like, let her know what you're wanting. Mm -hmm. My teeth are right there. <laughs> Not right there. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to your jaws? Right, right there. I'm gonna cut and I got this one out. You could have been talking before. You <laughs> <laughs> had all that time to talk. Oh. And Nikki said she think I got tea, tea something to where like, yeah, that. Because she said she had it and the same thing is happening to me. Like before I yawn, I got to like brace my jaw oh, to yeah. like, yeah. All that damn flopping. All that damn flop. Yeah. Get off my nerves. That's all that is. Turn this way a little bit. Washed out. <laughs> <laughs> what a tan it. I washed out. So guys, <laughs> to get my teeth cleaned by my cousin. <laughs> I've been flossing. Have you really? Yes, I have. Okay. Cause I started back using that Oral B two brush you got me, the electric yeah. spin one, yeah. and your teeth just feel so much cleaner with that. And I'm like, absolutely. You know what? Let me just go ahead and floss since it's I'm already feeling do clean. Way more than you can do. <laughs> I know it's crazy. Your teeth always are like pretty clean though. Yeah. Just like a little bit, and it's mainly from that flossing. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't get done. <laughs> hey, you <all> try it. Mm. <laughs> okay, close. Yeah, I went to the dentist. Um, y'all don't know. I talk about my cousin all the time. My cousin Dinah. She's a dental hygienist, period. Um, so proud of her. But she is my dental hygienist, obviously. So she just got done <laughs> cleaning my teeth. And then the doctor and stuff looked at my teeth. Basically, I went for a cleaning, but I also want an Invisalign. Um, my teeth in the front, I have an overbite if you guys don't know or can't tell. Um I probably put in that. I don't know if I'm gonna put in that picture or not, but I got an overbite. So when I smile, my teeth goes over this, and I just want to correct my overbite. Basically, like my teeth are straight and everything. It's just I got an overbite and I'm tired of it. So that's what we're gonna be doing. And I took pictures and images and stuff like that. I'll probably put the picture that I'm talking about in the thumbnail, but I may not <laughs> actually post it. So I should have had her put my freaking necklace back on. <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I'm sitting outside the um dentist so i need to go pay my rent as well today is is this all right yeah today is the last day to pay i keep forgetting to pay my rent because i gotta do money orders now and they usually just take it auto pay like you know whenever the day i set it for auto pay so i am right here by a kroger's um 
and I'm like, I might as well just go get a money order while I'm right here. But y'all did tell me that I can get a money order through my bank. And I am hungry. I haven't ate today. I kind of want Chick-fil-A. So I was thinking of just going to the bank that's close to a Chick-fil-A. Um, there's only a few Chase banks here. So I'm about to type in Chase. I'm going to call them and ask before I go waste my, waste my time over there. I'm pretty sure they probably can. Um, and the reason why... Obviously, I know money orders only cost like a couple dollars or whatever, but the reason why I want to actually get it from the bank since y'all said I could do that is because my bank, it automatically thinks it's some fraudulent activity going on every time I try to get a money order for my rent. Like, it declines the um, purchase and then they'll send me a message and then literally I'll just press yes like it's me and then it'll go through. So just to prevent that like it's just annoying they'll be like oh it declined i'm like i know like i gotta approve it just just to prevent all of that hoopla is this the right one yeah so i'm gonna call them and see what they say thank you for calling this is jasmine how can i help you uh -huh. i just wanted to see can we get money orders from like the bank yeah we do make money orders and cashier's checks um you have an account with us and everything yes i do Perfect. Yeah, so we, we can print them. Um, depending on what type of account you have, there may be a fee. Uh, money orders cost $5, and then cashier's checks cost $10. Okay, I have the total checking and then the one that pays early, secure checking. Okay, so yeah, for the secure checking account, the money orders and cashier's checks come free. Okay, great. Yeah. Okay, thank yeah. you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Okay. Period! Yeah! Okay, so actually what's funny is I was going to pay my rent through my secure checking account. And it's going to be free, baby! Okay, so, yeah, we're going to go ahead and head back to my neck of the woods because this is not my neck of the woods. <laughs> Today, um, I made a whole, like, content calendar and, like, just calendar for me for February. And my February is definitely booked up. So today, the only thing that I had on my calendar to do was come to my dentist appointment um, and pay my, well, I was supposed to pay my rent on the weekend. Anyways, dentist appointment and pay my rent today. Um, I do need to do a quick little she and whoop de whoop type of haul. And I feel like that'd be all for today. I'm going to tidy up my house just a little bit. Um, and I need to figure out what meals I want to eat for the rest of the week. This week should be exciting. It's my boyfriend's birthday this week. Um, so we're going to be doing some stuff for him tomorrow. Talk to y'all about that tomorrow. And then Wednesday, we're going to like go out to eat as well. And I work the... Anyway, so yeah. We got some exciting stuff to do. I'm super excited to bring y'all along for this week. I did want to actually stop by Michael's though because I think I want to make my own canvas. I know I told y'all that I didn't want any canvases in my apartment for like decor wise because I just feel like I'm over just having canvases like in my apartment like I want actual like art pieces like 3d type things so I do have something in my Amazon cart for my actual dining room area but that little bitty random wall right there in my living room I kind of want to do a canvas um you know with that little I don't even know what it's called that put whatever the stuff that's pink and then it dries white um I would like to kind of paint that black keep a little bit white and then maybe throw in a little bit of like brownish tan to really bring in the um brown colors in my apartment so we might go to michael's michael's i do have a 20 to 25 percent off coupon for them um since i'm already in this side of town i do need another bra um y'all know i got a 15 percent off coupon for uh park plaza well I got a 15% off coupon for Victoria's Secret and I kind of just want to go ahead and use it and I need a new bra anyway and they did have a special going on so we may or may not stop there today if I don't stop there today I'll go there um maybe like tomorrow or something we'll see so yeah I'll talk to y'all when we get to the bank Yeah, name for your order? Baker. Baker, okay. I just want that eight count nugget meal with a lemonade and ketchup. Eight count nugget meal, lemonade, ketchup? Mm hmm. How are you? Uh, the 1056. I have cash. Cash? Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll pull you one up for cash. Okay. Fifty-six, please. Okay. Excellent. Special, thank you. Thank you. 
for me. My battery's about to die, so I'll probably have to talk to y'all when I get home. It's so, alright, cause she's been dealing with them. Thank you. Yeah. You too. It's much later in the day. It's 5:28. I wanted to cook steak today, but girl, I didn't even take it out the freezer. So hopefully, it don't take long because they're not that thick. It's um two ribeye steaks. They're thin, so shouldn't take too long. I'm gonna let that do what it do. It's 5:27. Um, this is my little googie, good googie, goodie bag from the dentist. Cousin got me some toothbrushes. I got floss and chapstick and toothpaste. Um, they kind of straightened up just a little bit. I do need to do a little bit of dishes as well. I'm about to go ahead and take him back out since it's already 529. I've been posting content, so. If you don't follow me on Tiki Talk, then you can go follow me on Tiki Talk. All of my stuff is Akira Janae besides Instagram. My Instagram has been underscore Akira for years. So anyways, my Tiki Talk is Akira Janae, just like YouTube and stuff. My Instagram is underscore Akira. And then I was posting on my business page as well. Business page is obviously AJB Beauty Collection, a Clarosol platform. So I just posted this video i got 1200 views i got a thousand views in like 20 minutes so that was pretty good for that one but yeah i just posted my um i am now selling my raw vietnamese vendor if anybody is interested this isn't the raw vietnamese hair y'all know this is the version here that i'm trying out this is going to be available on february 21st okay but and i still like my package of it you can just go check out the website but i basically been doing that for like two and a half hours and now i was on the phone with bay or just you know just lolly lollygagging around kind of besides you know doing the content so what i'm gonna do right now i told y'all i was about to go do um i think i'm about to come back and unbox my new bike because i haven't been to the physical gym in like a week y'all know i've been doing my home workouts here at home like the two week ab challenge and stuff like that i did miss two days not even gonna lie so it's gonna have to go out past two days so i'm thinking that i want to go ahead and unbox this new bike so it says i have three days and six hours left on my um little two week challenge so we're gonna have to add like two more days today unless if i do the workout twice today so i'm excited to unbox this um i got it last week and i think i'm about to finally unbox it if y'all know y'all know if you follow me on instagram instagram kind of get the whole scoop of stuff first like in real time and then youtube y'all get it like a week or so later but they also left my package downstairs on the first floor you guys know i do not stay on the first floor i stay upstairs so they left this big, heavy A package downstairs. And another one of my neighbors, they left their package as well. And their package was a small package. It was like, y'all know HelloFresh. It was basically the um, thing called Factor and they just supply meals as well. Anyways, why are they leaving stuff down there? Like literally, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, that almost made me move out of here. Y'all know this has been my best favorite whatever apartment this far. And that whole situation was about to make me move. <laughs> Not even gonna lie, because this isn't the first time. This isn't the second time. This is like, this isn't even the third time. This is for sure the fourth time that has happened in the last month, month and a half. Ugh, I just don't understand. The other thing that they did, this was that was FedEx doing again. And UPS, they'll just leave like my regular packages at a different door or lie and say they delivered it and didn't deliver. So I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's because it's like a thousand damn apartments out here. I don't know. But that should not make you not do your job. So yeah, I'm gonna take him out and then we're gonna come back and unbox this because I am super excited to um put this up and use it because I do actually need to work out today. And by the time I'm working out, hopefully my food and stuff is done. So good morning. It is February 6th, Bay's birthday. I look a mess, so I'm not gonna show me. I made a huge mess last night trying to figure out what I was about to wear today to this cocktail making class and tour. So I have a lot of clothes to freaking pick up and hang up. I just made my bed and everything, but girl, I got clothes everywhere like a mess my house was spotless until i tried to find something to wear last night it took me like an hour and a half to try to find something to wear because the weather is tricky right now like it's 
the sun is out but it's still kind of breezy and then when that sun go down like it's going to be cold so i'm going to show you what i'm going to wear but i picked it out last night so it is 11 57 and he has a hair i said i won't go show myself but i just did my skincare and brush my teeth and stuff but um he has a haircut at 11 and i forgot to get a birthday card i thought i had one here but i don't so i gotta go to get a birthday card and get some balloons i already got his gift but i think i wanted to do a gift card as well um i remember him talking about that he needed like some workout clothes or whatever so i'm gonna let him pick up what he want but i was going to do a gift card like 50 dollars to the nike outlet and then another 50 dollars for hibbit sports but i'm like i ain't really been in hibbit sports in a minute and i don't really know what they got so i'm like should i just do a hundred dollars to the nike outlet because y'all know men's stuff is hot anyway like a shirt for them or a hoodie or sweatpants or something is fifty dollars alone so i'm like with the fifty dollars i'm only gonna get one thing you know unless it's on sale which the nike outlet usually has some sales but the nike outlet not that far from me so i'm about to shower do all of what i gotta do take prints out um clean up this mess a little bit before he get here he ain't gonna make it to me until like 1 1 30 because he is going straight to his haircut so i do got a little bit of time to do what i gotta do and clean up a little bit because he is gonna be here until thursday and today is tuesday so yeah um i don't know i wanted to get two different gift cards to two different places like i wanted to do then i wanted to do h m in the nike store but i'm like i don't even got time to go to the mall because when i go to the mall i do need to shop for me a new bra so I don't know we'll see i think i'm just gonna do 100 at the nike outlet store and then just let him do what he want to do at the nike outlet store and that just be that so i'm about to get off of here i'm gonna come back when i'm actually looking a little bit more presentable and put together and i gotta clean up all of this mess because girl trying to find an outfit if you know you know like it's a whole task just nosy gotta stop sharing my location with y'all tell couldn't even park first what did say this person yeah, I'll share when I get done in about an hour or so. <laughs> niggas, niggas can't ever handle no surprise. <laughs> you the one in the car calling me in the car. You call me! <laughs> Negro? <laughs> Just nosy. So the call y'all just heard is 12:15. He on the he on my freaking location trying to figure out where the heck I'm going. He this man cannot like have a surprise. It's just so funny. So I stopped sharing my location with him mid sentence when he like, oh you passing Landers. So I'm at the outlet or whatever or the outlet. Um, if you're local, obviously you know what I'm talking about. But girl, I'm talking about going to get him an H&M gift card from Park Plaza, like it's um another mall here and this is the outlet mall they got an h&m here uh, like so i'm gonna do 50 for nike and then 50 for h&m because he likes both places he like can shop at both um so yeah i just want to say it like that literally worked out in my favor Okay, so I'm back home. Just checked his location. He's still getting his hair cut. I just wanted to show y'all how cute is this. So I got him a, y'all know, a Nike gift card to Nike. This is so cute. The gift card comes in a little Nike box. Like, y'all. <laughs> I am a sucker for little stuff like this. This is just so stinking cute. So I'm gonna put the amount right here and then two in front of whatever. That's cute. And then y'all know I went to H&M. H&M got some nice, like, men's clothing. So... Um, got him one from H&M. I got the one with the little suit on there. And yeah, I'm gonna put it in here. And then his other stuff is already wrapped. Um, I got him a card. Dollar Tree didn't have any good cards this go around. So I'll probably write something real sweet right here. I did get a card. So I mean, I guess I won't write anything on that one. It's, I mean, it's, it'll do for a birthday. So I'm gonna put the H&M card in this one. And then I'm gonna put it in here so he don't know what it is. Cause I wasn't gonna get an envelope because I knew I was gonna get a card and I was gonna put it in here. But lady was like, you don't want an envelope? I'm like, sure girl, whatever. <laughs> so I'm gonna put it in here so he can't tell what it is. 
and then I'm gonna write in the card. And then this one, I don't know. I think I'm just gonna keep it like this because he's probably gonna be like, girl, what the hell is this? <laughs> what the hell is this? So yeah, and then his card goes in here. I'm gonna keep my receipts to scan these. She also let me put in my email for the H&M so I can get points. But I'm gonna scan these receipts on my Fetch app. I'm gonna put them in my purse. I don't got time to do it right now because I do need to hear up and write in this and get this together. And then y'all know I already showed y'all my messy apartment with all of my clothes everywhere. So I'm just gonna pick up all of my clothes and hang them up on the hanger. And then I do need to start doing my hair. I think I wanna crimp my hair. I crimped a little bit on this side last night and it seemed like it was turning out pretty cool because I wanted to wear my hair straight, but I feel like I'll just have to keep brushing it a lot because I can't get it just bone straight like the beauticians do. So I'm gonna crimp it so at least it'll still be that cute little like wave, like wavy straight, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna hear up and write in this car, get this stuff together. Oh, I also got him some balloons. Where his bag at? Girl, where I put his gift? Oh, over here. His gifts are wrapped crazy <laughs> because I didn't have any wrapping paper and honestly I didn't feel like going to get any because he's a man he don't really care anyway so I got his stuff wrapped up in just tissue paper so he can't see what it is and then I'm gonna go ahead and put the little cute Nike box <laughs> in there as well I'm gonna write the total that I got on here I put $50 on both cards just because I feel like you know Oh, and they also had a lot of stuff on sale at the Nike outlet store. So I feel like he'll be able to, you know, obviously he'll probably like spend 50 of his own money, but like free $50. I feel like that'd be really nice because they had a lot of stuff on sale. It's hard writing on this. Uh oh, Yeah, I should have did sharp because it's coming off, girl. Oh, well. Cute. So we're going to throw that in here. I'm just going to put that on the top. He can open that up before his other stuff, I don't care. And then I got two balloons from Dollar Tree. They didn't have like the color scheme I was going for, but just to have something on top of the bag. I like to always add balloons to stuff like Mother's Day, Valentine's Day, any day I like to add <laughs> balloons. So I'm gonna just put it on this last one right here. and keep it going like that. So I'm gonna have this front and center for him. I was gonna get in cake and stuff, but yeah, whatever. All right, I'm about to write on this card and then clean up and I'll get back to y'all when he get here. I'm gonna get like his first impression or whatever, like when he walk in to the uh, apartment. But other than that, I probably won't record him like open them. I don't know. I'll probably record me and then y'all can hear like him talking, so. So for his birthday, I booked us a tour and a cocktail making class. This is the tour at Rocktown Distillery. It is really something that you need to go check out. I really enjoyed it. He really enjoyed it. If you like to drink and kind of just learn more about what bourbon is, how bourbon is made and whiskey as well. The tour guide was amazing. I believe her name is Desiree. They show you the ins and the outs of everything. And it was just a really, really cool experience and tour. And he said he absolutely loved it. So I do recommend doing this. This is our still here. It's the same still we've been using since 2010. So that's the famous one. Yeah, she's so <laughs> older than she did in the picture up front, but so does Phil, right? So it's okay. Uh, so the way distillation works is that oh, once that grist is at the right like, texture, it gets pumped into the cooker here. That's what that machine's called. And then a um, human, also called a cooker, is going to come <laughs> and cook down those grains for a specified amount. Mash bill is going to have how long you cook it, how much water you add to the grist to make a mash, how hot you cook it for, like all of those things are going to be. Um, if I pick up something and you absolutely know you don't want to try it, even with a drop of water, you can just flip your glass upside down on your napkin. That's like a non verbal way of letting me know. Hey, no, thank you. Um, these are all going to be quarter to half ounce pours, um, so not a whole bunch, but if you want more after the tasting, the bar is going to be open till. <laughs> 9.30. We're doing a special these days on Tuesdays. We're doing two, it's $2 Tuesday, so it's $2 off the cup. Okay, so very similar in mm -hmm. recipe. Yeah. American so, corn and vodka. Right? Okay. They're both the same. Hmm. Well, in that way. Yeah, yeah. 
but I I know more than I would say more than five oh, Tito's yeah. drinkers who have switched over to Rocktown. If it gives me smooth thing, for sure. Me, mm -hmm. but, I don't know, man. It's good. It's giving me I'm a little green. <laughs> giving me I'm a little green, but this is not as harsh as Tito. Yeah. And it's also mm -hmm. better price point. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> right. Yeah, that, that is that is smooth. Mm -hmm. Clean out. Right. <laughs> I'm sorry. Water that gets you drunk. That's it. yeah. It's not the bourbon. <laughs> Next up, we're gonna do the lemon vodka. So we've got five flavored vodkas. We've got the grapefruit. We've got watermelon. We've got mandarin orange. We've got basil that's really unique to Rocktown. That's good. And then the lemon, which is my personal fave. I think it's the most versatile. It's great for taking shots. Great for making mixed drinks. Mm. Really, what else are you doing with vodka? But it's really, good. <laughs> it's really good for those things. Right. So if the first one was water that gets you drunk, this one is lemonade that gets you drunk. Mm. But our flavored vodkas are lightly sweetened. So mm -hmm. They go down a bit easier. They're a little bit um, diluted from the flavoring, so they're going to be 70 proof rather than 80. Like the I like that one. Makes me wonder who you think So like I said, I booked a tour and a cocktail making class every month. I believe they do these classes. So if there's a holiday that falls on the month, they do like two specialty cocktails. So since this is February and it's Valentine's Day, they have two different specialty Valentine's Day cocktails. This was the first one they were making. You can see me making it. Yeah, I like that. As well as you can see my boyfriend making his on the right side of the screen. This was super fun. So basically I would make it, well the tutorer or whatever he went well the bartender he would show us how to make it and then i would make it and then the men would make it it's kind of how everybody did it they let the women go first obviously um this one was really good i think the thing that i didn't like about this i think it had like red pepper in this one or something and i didn't like that so i should have put a lot more strawberry than the red pepper but all in all it was a really really nice class and the drinks were amazing <laughs> Come on, for the strawberry. Mm -hmm. You said for, you said for the vodka too? <laughs> I mean, hey, I'm not saying no. <laughs> Come on, recording. Uh, what's next? Okay, next, next question for the, you. The, the, the comedy stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this one. Uh, uh, I have. Yeah. It's close enough. It's supposed to be the small side, but that oh. works. <laughs> the the okay. I forgot exactly. You were supposed to pour that in there with it. So for the cream to be we go all the way up to the first line there. Yeah, you were supposed to keep it in there and then pour that with it. So just do uh, half. No, 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 just do half. What we do is we start with the frozen strawberries. Whip it up how I want to. Boil we'll do it the right way. Right way. Not how I want to. As close as I can. Close. <laughs> Alright, cut the camera. Cut the camera. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> So it's 12.20 and we just got back home, got some water burger. I got a burger, bacon cheeseburger and some fries. Then I got my drink, lemonade. 
Take your son out the room. Please. <laughs> Hello, poopies. All right, get down, I'm eating. <laughs> and he got a chicken strip burger, whatever. We had so much fun. I'll do a recap probably tomorrow because I'm really tired and I'm starving. <laughs> and I'm about to eat because my food is hot, fresh. Let me take this sweater off. So yeah, we had so much fun though. The distillery was really nice. Like I said, I'll probably recap tomorrow or voiceover. Kira probably had already told y'all some stuff. Just I'm glad I got my hair cut today. <laughs> you ain't gotta be on camera. <laughs> we are at Waffle House, obviously, as you can see. It's 11 27 in the morning. They making our stuff. We about to eat. Only thing is, I can't ever scoop up and eat. Like, I be needing to be this close. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, we're at Waffle House. I haven't been to Waffle House in a couple years. He used to go all the time in college, though. College and high school. That's about it. I don't eat eggs. You know that. And dang sure not on no sausage and biscuit. <laughs> Did you need um, jelly or anything? Yeah. Uh, I'm playing Jay. <laughs> Yuck. We're at the mall now, Park Plaza. A lot of y'all that be asking me where I got my bed from. I got it from this mall, it's a um, furniture store inside the mall, and that's where I got it from. It's called Melissa's Furniture, right over there. This is the store. Y'all can get y'all bed, my bed up in there. Real cute, real cute. What? <laughs> Too late now. You can feature for your team. Right. Right. When you get the big fully Fully instructor. Every time. I mean, well, only right now you could have had it for 30 days. 30? Yeah, that's what I'm right. trying to tell you. Right. <laughs> okay. You are now ready Trust. to enter the car. Yes, and then you can cancel anytime. Thank you. 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 Well, actually, I ain't no, never I'm had nobody be up there at the front though. Like at the genius genius that I go to, ain't nobody at the front to do that. They only right be here. Be Get his truck washed. He needs it real bad. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hey, I'm back home. So, how about it is 3:33? I don't know if I told y'all today. It's the dad's birthday, Wednesday, February 7th. So, get a notification from FedEx again, girl. And why would they say your package has? Sorry, <laughs> your package has been delivered. I get on there. Why well, check the picture? I'll probably pop it right here if I feel like doing all that editing. It's downstairs on the first floor. So, I didn't have to run around while we was at the mall calling people the first number i called it was 1-800 number she like typed it in like the system or whatever but y'all know stuff like that it takes time to process whatever and it just takes too long so i remember when it's happened the very first time this is by this is by the way like the fourth or fifth time this has happened to me um i had talked to a guy named wesley so i talked to wesley again today 
and i'm like this this is just keep happening like wh why are y'all not bringing it upstairs basically so anyway the first girl she took my number tracking number all of that she put it in the system okay cool second lady i talked to she gonna tell me that fedex don't bring stuff upstairs when has uh any shipping company not brought stuff upstairs to somebody's apartment you know like it don't matter what it is so i'm like you know what ain't it <laughs> trying to do better y'all know i didn't stop cussing and stuff like that i may do some slip ups here and there a few words but for the most part i'm really good at not cussing anymore so i'm like you know what it's obviously not her fault so i learned not to take stuff out of other people but it's just like so annoying so i just hung up in her face <laughs> okay cool so i finally found a number that i had talked to wesley call up wesley okay okay cool he called his guys again they came back up and put my package upstairs and then the guy gonna call me and he said, yeah, this is your fetish job. I was gonna see if you had anybody to help. Why do I gotta have somebody to help? Like, if y'all know y'all got bigger packages or, you know, like, first off, I'm just gonna say, I know how the shipping process and stuff like that work. I, I didn't work there, but like, I saw it like firsthand. So if somebody have to, if they have a lot of, like, if they have a bigger load on their truck, I guess you can say, like, even Amazon. Amazon would send two men. Like, I got furniture delivered before. They sent two men to bring up stuff from Amazon. But that is Amazon. They're the best shipping company, in my personal opinion. But I'm like, if you know you got these heavy packages, why are they not, why are they not sending two people on the truck? Like, girl, anyways, my package is up here. But for the fourth or fifth time, they have left my big-ass package downstairs on the first floor. So... I'm gonna do a little haul. <laughs> Me and Bay went to y'all saw Park Plaza, the actual mall, but I'm really feeling the outlet malls now at this point, especially the one over there at Bass Pro. If y'all are local, I haven't shopped over here and I don't know how long. So he used his two gift cards that I got him yesterday. He used the H&M and the Nike gift card. He still got ten dollars left on the Nike gift card. Anyways, we went to Levi's. We went to Nike. We went to Express. We went to H&M. We went to the Lids a hat store. He got a hat. Uh, we didn't. We had a good little, you know, shopping day, bonding day. So I got some stuff from Levi's. I just got a pair of pants. Uh, I think this is my first time ever buying pants from Levi's. So these were actually on sale, thirty nine ninety eight. They were regular, um, sixty nine fifty, so seventy dollars. I am now a twenty nine by thirty two, if that's how you say it. So wide, like waist twenty nine. Well, really, I'm a twenty eight, but. Since I know I am still trying to gain 10 pounds back of my weight because I'm 143, I'm trying to get back to 153. I went ahead and just got the 29 because I feel like it got just a little bit more like wiggle room just in case. So, yeah, um, I got 29 by 32. I like longer jeans, so I am glad I decided to keep looking because the other jeans stopped at a, at a um, 30. And I don't like that. Like, I want mine to be 32. So now that I actually went to a, you know, like, blue jean, <laughs> like, jeans store... I know what to look for. 29 by 32 is what I like. So that's what I got. Just some regular Levi jeans. These are my first ever Levi's. I'm super excited. They are really good quality. So I understand why they cost what they do. I mean, they've been they been that girl since high school. My best friend used to always get Levi jeans. So yeah, got me a nice little pair of light washed jeans. These are their, if you care, 721 high rise. And yeah, I absolutely love and they were actually cheaper than $39. I don't know if I was recording. They were actually $21. They rung up for $19, but I paid $21. So we love a good sale. I was going to run back and give me another pair, but I'm like, Akira, the point of a sale is to get it on sale, like not to go buy more. So <laughs> I contained myself. Then from Victoria's Secret, girl, I'm super excited. I had a $25 gift card from my cousin Dinah, who in the beginning of this, y'all saw she was cleaning my teeth. She's my dental hygienist and also my cousin. So she gave me a $25 gift card. I used that today. My total was $78, but I only paid like $50 um, because I also had a 15% off coupon. So the bra that I had to pre-order basically was the Infinity Flex Lightly Lined that bra i'm telling y'all if you're looking for a good bra go to victoria's secret and buy that bra it's called infinity flex lightly lined if y'all don't already have it girl it is so nice and then this one that i got is just called it don't really say anything it's just one of their bras but that infinity bra yeah y'all definitely need to go get that one so yeah that's it don't say a name it's just one of those lightly padded bras really soft no underwire because i cannot take it anymore and yeah, that's the bra guy. Um, did go up 
a cup size <laughs> so i'm a 34 triple d now and i'm not a 32 that's why i'm excited to switch out of this bra y'all can see i'm like spilling out of this because my cup size has gotten bigger because i'm like why are my bras so uncomfortable why do i feel you know so bad in them it's because my cup size is bigger so got a bigger cup size absolutely love the um one that i ordered the infinity bra that's going to come in like a brown color like she said it's going to be like my skin tone so i really really like that and then she also gave me two coupons i ain't gonna turn around because girl y'all ain't about to get my little code <laughs> but it starts february 21st through march 5th which is good she gave me two of them and i get 20 dollars off a of 50 dollars purchase and i get a free mist or a lotion so i'm super excited about that 50 dollars, y'all know it's easy to spend up in victoria's secret and pink so one of these i'll probably use for some more underwear and then the other 20 dollars off <laughs> I'll probably either get pajamas or I'll get another bra because I really am trying to get my bra collection up because I just need bigger, you know, better bras, especially because since my cup size went up, the bras that I got, they're size 32. So, you know, they ain't gonna work out for me no more. So yeah, that's all I got. I didn't do too much. Bay the one who got, he got some Valentino cologne. He, he didn't, he didn't spend some money today. <laughs> I didn't stay on the, you know, calmer side of things. So what I say? It's 3.41. I'm not going to start getting ready until like 4.40. Um, our reservation is at 6.30. And it's only like 10, 15 minutes away. So I don't have to, you know, get ready that early. Especially because my hair is basically already done. Um, I probably put a few more like crimps in it. But for the most part, I'm just going to wear it like this. I'm just doing my makeup. My makeup should take about 30 minutes. And then I'll just kind of refresh up my hair. And honestly, that's it. Besides makeup, I'm wearing a dress tonight. So... Yeah, I'll talk to y'all when I'm getting ready. I probably Yeah. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't see him. I'm in the background. Yes. <laughs> hey, yeah. it is. Is it right here? I do. Can you move up? Jasmine. Excuse me, Jasmine. Can you take us to your little bed? Here we go. again this is my virgin hair that i sell that's going to drop february 21st if you're interested in wearing wavy i absolutely love i'm falling in love again with the virgin hair because it's just so much easier to take care of rather than raw hair like yes ma'am give it to me so yeah i'm about to finish the little touches and stuff of my hair my face is good 
my face is good i believe um may do a little highlight i need to do a lip i probably do a little lip gloss a little lip liner or something and yeah that's it there's shit up there that's a border of a cotton candy <laughs> so aesthetically pleasing <laughs> you know you gotta do it for the aesthetics i'm flooded <laughs> We at the experience right now. <laughs> I'm lit. I had a good little drink. We here for his birthday celebration. <laughs> My drink was real good. I put it on the screen. Makeup, face beat, period. Okay, it looks real good. <laughs> it's a vibe. Okay, let's turn around. Birthday. I'm 27, bro. Oh man. You know, you know, you know, get more life. More life. More life. Young Period. <laughs> <laughs> right, I didn't record. No, you. Oh. <laughs> no, come come on, on now, man. Okay, okay, come on. He, he wasn't in my camera. Okay, come on. Why not take it? Shit. <laughs> 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 oh, I got the photo off the way. I don't really gotta take a shot. <laughs> Keep going, keep going. Bro, just take I can't it off. just throw it just back. Just take it back, bro. Just avoid the tongue. Avoid the tongue. Literally, you just like throw it back. You thinking about it, gang. I can't. Yes, you can. I'll do it with you. I can't have that much liquid in my mouth. Bro, yes, you can, bro. Because then it made me want to throw up. Just don't think about it, bro. I, I, Stop thinking about it, bro. Just do it. Drunk. It's not going to make a difference. <laughs> I can't. Yummy. There you go. Right, now, yes, there you now, go. Now, now, finish the rest of that. I'm so just, just go back. Go. Just don't think That's about it. Not, no. That's not a lie. Come on. You got it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Y'all leave my baby alone, man. She know her limits. It's okay. We, we love it anyway. That's okay, man. There it is. There you go. First time. I'm kind of scared. I'm not a shot girl. I'm a cocktail girl. <laughs> That's why I got you one coming. Another one yeah, Miss Mel. Huh? 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 We gonna be okay. Tell him. Tell him. Tell him. Tell him, boo. Tell him. Besides this, besides this week, everybody. On YouTube, <laughs> yeah. Hey, this my this my right hand. For sure, for sure. You know what I'm we lie like channel. It's my you birthday. Get what I'm saying. We lie like Channel Five. What you talking about? Shit, salute. This this number I don't know who again. God damn. God damn.
kind of good. <laughs> on me. I got to be over the keys. I'm just horrible at both. I ain't got no aim. So. You just roll it straight. I just, I'll be trying. That's bad. Uh, I'll be right. I know I gotta be aware of something, but that's You do. It's alright, y'all. You're gonna make it. I promise you, you're gonna make it. It's a half day, it don't matter. You know, we're gonna make it. Salute. Salute. We're gonna do it. Hey, I'm not gonna lie. It's your time, my shit. No, that's cool, that's cool. Let's take a sip. It's on you, brother man. It's on you, birthday boy. Shot o'clock. Shot o'clock. 27, y'all. 27. Happy birthday to my boy. Got her old man. You know what I'm saying? There it is. What's that car? What you give me a sex on the beach again? Yeah, same thing. Same thing. What did we? Oh, oh, man. Man. Do not record the scope. I just know I'm going to record the scope. Wait till the end. Get the now, scope. If I'm still in the end. I show them them two strikes I got. They gonna, show get, them the... they gonna be on there at the end. Like damn. Like wait till the end. Tell them the Thanksgiving game. might come early. And you report. There you go. Give me a second, <laughs> Are you recording? You sure? I'm recording. It's on. It's red. Okay. It's red. Okay. It's the only thing she gonna get. Only one. It's the only one she gonna get. Damn! I thought you picked that up. I thought you picked that up. Almost. Almost, man. Talk to me now. I'm gonna be in the gym with Josh every day. <laughs> Like, when you going, Josh, let me know. Hey, this is Jill. This, this, this is Jill. This, this is Jill. Don't do too much now. I'm like, when, like, going, when I lock back in the gym, don't trip. When the last time you been in the gym, Josh? Really yeah, like yeah. when, I, when I lock back in the gym, it's over. The eight months. You ain't been in the gym in eight months? Well, first of all, it's been like eight months. Been like, you sound like Kevin Hart. It's only been like four. Got transfer money from my from my savings to my checking. 
<laughs> it's like 24 hours. It's only been like, <laughs> it's only been like four months, gang. Oh my God. But when I log back in, when both is over. <laughs> I don't think you got the turkey in you. I don't think you got it. So three strikes is a turkey? You ain't got it. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. You still went on. I'm cool, bro. Bro. I'm at 78. I ain't worried about it. But listen. I ain't worried about it. Bay is at 83. So we really ain't. We really ain't. No. We laugh. I'm at 78. Good 78, 79, 80, 1, 2, 3. He only got five more points than me. Right, you yeah, one more. Okay. There it is. So it really ain't that even. It ain't even that bad. Man, your ass look like oh, <laughs> his, I think his you luck ran out. Right. His luck ran out. Come on, man. Because one, you did have a good hey. ball earlier. Nah, he gonna win. He gonna win this bitch. Yeah, but he at 130 right now. As long as he don't do good, he, he got it. it. Hey, get a gun. <laughs> <laughs> Walk Damn. off. time it was so fun had so much fun with everybody my friends and stuff and Bay. he said he really enjoyed himself these past two days up here with me and just celebrate his birthday and stuff my battery's about to die so i don't know what i'm gonna do because all the battery dead so girl <laughs> i forgot to even put them on the thing like me and Bay fell asleep in the floor for like two at like last night crazy <laughs> he should be coming up any second with some chick-fil-a i was trying to vlog because prince um i ordered him that fresh fresh farmers the food what is it then what is it called farmer's dog i believe is what it is yes farmer's dog and it just got delivered today so i'm about to go get that and do a little unboxing i probably record on my phone until my batteries charge up a little bit because they're literally both did so i want to post it on tiktok as well so i'll just pop in the footage that i get on my phone so we're gonna be unboxing prince food it's a 28 day supply this is not sponsored by the way i just wanted to treat my baby and get all oh, they oh, they gave the little box for it so this is what you put the food in to like measure out how much you're supposed to give. So it got one fourth, one half, and then a one fourth right here again. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad they Don't included try. this. <laughs> Dog version. These are the free snacks that they gave Prince. They're called Snap Sticks. Chicken, apple, and sea salt for fiber, protein, and electrolytes. That's why I like them. Let's get Okay, from the side. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's cold as hell, too. 
It just goes back. <laughs> Ooh, this ice cold, baby. This beef. It's crazy how they send stuff like this. He got his food. It's frozen solid, so I'm probably gonna have to start this. What, tomorrow or tonight sometime, probably? I cannot wait, that's a lot of food. I'm gonna give him one of these treats that they gave us. <laughs> what? <laughs> Watching the behind the seat. Food, huh? <laughs> I like them. You like them, poops? <laughs> I think that's a yes. <laughs> right, get you some healthy food. Yes, sir. You expensive. I got two expensive boys. <laughs> so, my tire popped last night. It's flat. I'm at work, Josh and Bay here. It's saving the day. <laughs> you can't make this up. My life is a joke. Like, I don't get it. Ain't you supposed to raise it up first? Or the wheel yeah. is gonna fall off? Clearly, <laughs> I know that before I was loosening it. <laughs> what are you doing shit then? I'm gonna leave it to y'all. You putting this on the vlog or yes. something? Oh, my boy still got the suit on. Hey, <laughs> fresh that's, off work. That's real. That's real. That one. Jesus That's real. It's the lot, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really, really recording this for my own knowledge, too, though. This is the lock, Akira. Yeah, you use this to take the lock off. Good shower <laughs> and a massage. What you talking about? Man. It's a he one I got. Man, you need a good break. <laughs> well, I just bought bread. Fuck, fuck now, nah, fuck that. <laughs> I need a home. Well, I'm about to go cook some bacon and stuff, so. realized I didn't have a true ending to this vlog. I look a mess. I just woke up. I am exhausted. Last night and yesterday was just a horrible night starting off and there at work. It was just too much. Disregard my hair. Like I literally just got up out of bed. Um so yeah I just wanted to end this vlog <laughs> the weekly vlog because I want to be posting this tomorrow. I'm actually about to start editing it. I'm about to start editing I'm about to start editing this video tonight. So I just wanted to say, don't forget to like this video, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for tuning in again. I cannot wait to start a new vlog tomorrow. Um, this is the week of Valentine's Day, so it's going to be really exciting and really special. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Like I said, I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.